There was this uh, talk of uh, INEC trying to frustrate your party uh, in getting materials uh, just before you got to this uh, particular uh, verdict, which you say you will appeal against. But uh, another word from the streets uh, in Adamawa State, uh, some say uh, there's uh, some kind of religious coloration. In politics, uh, how can you explain that if you've heard of uh, that argument? What was my second question on that? Well, there, there seem to be some allegations of religious coloration in this uh, particular process in your state, and people wonder how come uh, they arrived at this uh, particular uh, uh, argument. No, 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 no. You know, you see, Adama State is a very complex state. We have 85 different ethnic groups in Adama State. That's you have 85 languages in Adama State. And everybody would like to smear the other one by bringing one thing or another. Let me tell you one thing. ACN as a party in Adama State, of all the 21 local governments, there are 16 local government uh, chairmen that are Muslims. And then you have just five that are Christians. And then you have the chairman of the party in the state it's a, it's, it's a Muslim. And it's only me who happens to be a Christian as a candidate. My, my deputy is a, is, is a Muslim. Now, for anybody to tell you that we have religious intolerance in the ACN, is, you know, he must be a dreamer, or he doesn't come from Adama State. In fact, I'll tell you that. Do you have more of the Christians in the PDP of Adama State than there are in the ACN? So, you know, if you look at the religious intolerance, that is just an imagination of somebody along the line. And, you know, most of the people who actually voted for ASEAN are Muslims and not Christians. And therefore, we have to look at the, the way we are. And we must be able to, to, to bring up a, a state that is very, very tolerant of one another. And for your information, in Adama State, there are hardly any families that do not have mixed religions in the family. You find today maybe a, a family of 10, six of them are Muslims, four are Christians, or vice versa. There are very, very few. We have intermarried, we have people, that, we have religious tolerance in Adama State, and there's nobody who can come and bring religious politics in Adama State. You must work with one another to be able to be a governor of Adama State. Otherwise, you've, you are bound to fail. But today we have a situation where the present governor has only 10 people working for him, and all these people are his relatives. All of them are his relatives. There's nobody, again, who knows anything that's happening in that state, apart from those 10.